Hey, welcome to the channel or welcome back if you're a subscriber. Well, Royal Caribbean has a program called The Key, which is supposed to give you premier access to exclusive events on your cruise. So what is it exactly and what will it cost you? Tune in to find out. Okay, before I get into it, I'd like to invite you to subscribe if you're not a subscriber. It sure helps my channel grow and I'd really appreciate it and give a thumbs up if you're liking it. Thanks. Okay, the key. You have to purchase the key pre-cruise and everyone in your stateroom that's over six years old also has to purchase the key. And remember when you purchase pre-cruise things, you must purchase within 48 hours of the date of your cruise. They cut it off at that 48 hour mark and you're not able to purchase anything pre-cruise. Okay, to get to the spot where you're gonna purchase that key, go to royalcaribbean.com and sign in. It'll bring up your cruises. You get your cruise that you're going on and that blue button where it says manage or plan my cruise, click on that. When that comes up, all the shore excursions will be first. You have to scroll down to the bottom of the page where it says VIP passes. It doesn't say key, it's VIP passes. You click on that and a screen will come up that shows you how much it'll cost per day. But you'll have to click on that again to bring up what you're really gonna get. It'll summarize what you're gonna be getting for that $28 a day, which on my cruise, $28.99. So, you will get uh, priority access at the terminal um, during your boarding time. Uh, you will get um, a, a free drop-off service of your carry-on luggage, so you don't have to schlep it all over the ship. You'll get an embarkation day luncheon, and that'll be from the Chops Grill menu, so that's pretty good. I love, love me some chops. Um, you'll get... Uh, private time on any of the onboard activities like the flow rider or the rock climbing wall, uh, things like that. You'll get private time. You will get um, priority departure if there's any tender ports that you're going to. Um, you'll also get uh, an a la carte breakfast when you debark. And so that's a nice perk too. And then you can choose whatever time you want to get off the ship. That's no problem. And on the shows, you will get special seating right in the front row, the best seats available. Um, if reservations are required on the ship that you're traveling on, you're going to have to make your reservations. You don't get it just because um, just because you have the key. You have to make the reservation. But on the other ships that you don't have to make reservations, you just get the key and then you go down to that area where you can sit. And then I think the most important feature is that you get the internet for one device, that room, surf, and stream. And I think that's a good value. Now, how much is all of that going to cost you? It depends on your cruise. On my 17-day transatlantic cruise, it's $28.99. So that's like $4.92 for the entire cruise. On my five-day cruise to Bermuda later in the year, it's $35.99. I think that comes up to about $180. So if you have it in your budget, um, but it's kind of a hefty price. If you have like kids in the room, everyone would have to get it over the age of six. So it just, uh, it's up to you. If you've got it in your budget, you might want to look at it. Okay. Do I think the key program is worth it? Well, I think the internet is the best perk in that package. And if I bought the internet for $17.99 a day, on my 17 day cruise uh, for 11 more dollars a day, I could get all those other perks too. So if it's in your budget and you're gonna get the internet package anyway, it's worth looking into the key. So see you on your travels. And if you're over there at that key luncheon, I'll wave and say hi. <laughs> <laughs>